Hey folks, welcome back. It's Pokemon Sunday. Oops. Gaga Guawa. Gaga Guawa. Shoddy got me saying Gaga Guawa. <laughs> Are you taking the gym challenge now? Hoping to see Candace. Ice type matches up badly against fighting. All right. Oh, oh. I accidentally just started battling this person. Am I healed? Ah! Okay. Level 35. Uh, am I healed? Okay. Gaga Guawa, dude. All right, I think we could probably one shot with Toxic Couch. Uh, fighting is super effective against Dark. You're absolutely right, Wintermute. Uh, what are the conditions? Uh, random everything for trainers. Um, hold on, let me, let me, let me, let me. Let me deal with this. Oh, I was like, I gotta get to ice real quick. Um, I guess we'll go just a nibble, since we don't really have any, yeah, we don't have anything to deal with uh, flying right now. Um, trainers are fully, fully random. Uh, wild Pokemon are random one-to-one, -one, so. Uh, wow. Good guess. Good guess. Um, doesn't matter though. Um, wild Pokemon are one-to-one -one swapped per area, so, uh, if an area would have a Swellow, maybe instead it will have a Golduck for the entire area. Uh, legendaries are swapped one-to-one. -one. Um, can't find a legendary in random grass. Items are random. Skuntank. This is... I always forget Skuntank. Is it normal poison, dark poison... I don't know. I'm just gonna surf it. Poison Dark. Poison Dark's a pretty good combo in this gen. Oh. And a nibble gets another level, folks. It's disgusting is what it is. Yeah, he probably saw someone outside. Saw some uh, shadows under our doorway. The top idol, to win everyone's heart, I'll sing my heart out in snowy snow point to a crowd of none. This is Grace, thanks for listening, Jesus. He's a good pure guy that doesn't like poison or dark, absolutely. He's a psychic type and he's mad he can't be super effective against poison. Nope, I don't know that. Oh, in the temple, there's a temple here. Temple. All right, let's give McRib the old exp share. Folks, if you don't remember, right at the end of last stream, we caught McRib. Oh, thank you, Twilight Sentinel. Hello to Twilight Sentinel's living room. Check out that friggin' attack! Ooh! Ooh, that attack! Unfortunately, we have, oop. That's the fifth month in a row you've been here. Don't you say goodbye, hello! Welcome back, Protagonizzi! Uh, for five months, Brave Bird. Uh, we take serious damage from this, but it's a very powerful attack. Uh, we'll probably be using these two for the meantime. Um, I can't believe we have both Aeroblast and Spatial Rend, which are the same move, just different type. And then Tailwind, which is fine. We'll get rid of Tailwind soon. Uh, we gotta go back and fight all the trainers on the previous route as well. I knew it. You can't trick me. I know there's some ice-cold lemonade. I bet that would be very refreshing. I'll be honest. 
That would restore 70 of my HP. What do you got to say? Can I get full restores yet? I cannot buy full restores. I cannot buy full restores. Fill restores. Let's get rid of our protector because we definitely can't do anything with it. Paul, oh, welcome back. 16 months. Good to see you. Question, folks. What would you say if I said I was going to play some... Uh, Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening on Tuesdays. I'd say I wish I didn't have a job. Well, there will be replays available, probably. Where are my, there we go, Pearl. All right. It does hit different than a live stream. I agree with you. When possible, it's much better to watch a stream live. I have an entire ship, but nobody can use it until somebody beats the Pokemon League. Okay, so this grass can have uh, McRibs in it, um, who are very powerful creatures, uh, but should be able to be defeated by... Well, actually, let's see who can learn Ice Beam real quick, because we now have access to the Ice Beam TM immediately after we lost. It was almost like a trade. It was like a devil's trade. McRib is the only one that can learn it. Um, which isn't horrible, uh, but his special attack is lower than his attack. So ideally we're getting attack instead. Protagonizzi, I'm afraid we lost McFlurry. Is this a different route? Oh, we haven't caught on Akuity Lakefront, guys. Let's, uh, try it. Yeah, Ren, it, it, it's definitely not great. The only Pokemon we can catch at Akuity Lakefront is a Feraligator. Question, guys, is this dupes? I think we have decided that same line as dupes. Because we have uh, Croconaw. Okay, this is dupes. Dupes. Stomp. Let's see what that does. Not bad. All right. Dupes. Moving on to the next one. Democracy was in a different run. Yeah, yeah. That Snorlax was good. Um, is dupes a rule or an option? It's it's uh, an option that you have based on a rule. So my option is I don't have to catch this for alligator. Or I, I, I can potentially catch something else. Done veto. All right. The only Pokemon we can catch on this route is...
Okay. Great. Fantastic. Again, feasibly dangerous. Uh, let's go to a nibble. Ice coverage. Okay. Okay, we're gonna rock smash it. Aurora beam, all right. Okay, so rock smash crit might kill here. Does he still have charge beam? True. I'm gonna I'm gonna heal up first. Ice Fang. So we've seen Aurora Beam, Ice Fang, and Bone Rush. I think we have to we have to hope we don't crit. I don't think we're gonna catch it at this rate, so. A crit would suck, but. Nice. It's good, Praetor. We're doing all right. We just uh, encountered this as a wild Pokemon, which, in my opinion, is neat. Uh, let's go ahead and Ultra Ball it. One and done, baby. Ready? Wiggle number one. Wiggle number two. Wiggle number three. Okay. Uh, am I remember correctly? We lost Bucket. You were not. We lost Bucket to a Slow King. We were afraid we were going to lose Bucket to a uh, Mamoswine um, in that first city. Uh, first big city, but we didn't. Um, okay. This will be a catch. We lost Pretzel, right. That's a catch, folks. Mamoswine was caught at the Acuity Lakefront. GG, easy. A frozen one was dug up from soil dating back 10,000 years. It woke up to much amazement. I, yeah. I mean, that's just Aang, right? I guess it's only a hundred years, but. That's more of a fun fact than a Pokedex entry. Yeah, that said nothing about the species other than that it can survive. Uh, okay. Babe, <laughs> Praetor. Uh, Mama Jamma, Ella Pig, Frosty, Mamatar, Mimosa. I'm not sure if we're using uh, this Pokemon. We might. Yip Yip. Mama's wine, Appa, Yip Yip. Mama's wine, <laughs> I didn't get it, but now I get it. Mama's wine? Mama's wine is, uh, Mama's wine and Appa and Yip Yip are the three. Mama's wine. Okay, so just, just so you know, it has to be Without an apostrophe. Okay, Mama's Wine is big time the winner. Mama's Wine. Mama's Wine, the Mama Swine. Was transferred to hell, no. There's no time. We have to save Mama's Wine. hot wine. You don't like mulled wine? Mulled wine can be nice. The in-game weather is the same as the weather outside your window? Dude, that is what we call augmented reality. All right. Let's take a look at Mama's wine. Does not anymore have charge beam, so we'll want to probably train that. Good stats, good stats. 95 attack, 75 speed. Uh... Do not look back at Mama's Wine while retrieving them from hell. True. Yeah, bad moves. I mean, you know, 
Ice Fang's not horrible. Bone Rush is pretty bad. Ice Fang's like, whatever. I mean, it's it's physical at least, which is helpful. It's better than like a 90 power, 95 accuracy ice move that's special, so. Uh, hasty nature. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I let's take a look at our team. I guess if we were gonna switch it, it would probably be verboten at this point, right? The thing is verboten has such good use against psychic types, against normal types, against uh, so many. Um, Big and McRib filling the same niche? Uh, somewhat, yeah. Not really. Kind of. Kind of, yeah. Um. <clears throat> the thing is, Don Vito and, uh. And Mama's Wine will also be somewhat, um. Doing the same thing. I'm sure, I'm sure Mama's Wine can learn stuff, yeah. Uh, can we get the Colonel a slot on the team? I think Mama's Wine is just a very good backup right now, honestly. I, I don't think we're switching the team for them. Yeah, Verboten's typing has been really, really effective this run. Yeah, Torterra is wise. Unfortunately, Torterra is also ground, so it's like... It's not as effective as it could be. Let's take a quick look at Zen Headbutt and see, because I haven't checked this in a little while. It's a good move. Uh, Big could learn Zen Headbutt, uh, but it's physical. Uh, Aura Sphere, we have our fighting type now. Um... A nibble could learn it if we forget something. We were gonna forget cut, right? Am I gonna need cut again? Does anybody remember offhand? And then we have judgment. Who can learn judgment? Only Don Vito and Toxic Couch, each of whom. Not great. Uh, you could, yes, Waxy Frenchie. I think that's fair. All right. Let's uh let's go train, I guess. Um Let's go kill those trainers on that route. I think it's fun that there's actually an ice Pokemon in the ice route. Music slaps. Um, however, since there's an ice Pokemon, let's get let's get Toxic Couch up there. He could handle uh, Mammoth Swine. Could uh, Big as well? Fire Punch, but I would take Ice Fang. Toxic Couch is a better move against those, but. Toxic Couch is a horrible move against Sal- Oh, we're not in the Salamence yet. Okay. Also can't handle for Alligator. Okay, so let's kill a couple of these guys. Oh wait, no, we have trainers. Why am I fighting wild Pokemon when we have trainers? Mamoswine, you're going down fast. You're going down, baby. Oh, not quite going down. Now you're going down, baby. All right, moving on out. If only you could get three Reggies, yeah. All right, so now it's uh, potential Salamences. We need rock moves or I guess Verboten should be up there. Boy, Salamences, no joke, huh? A war turtle! Good! We're seeing all of the water starters on this route. Going down, down in an earlier round. Okay, let's uh, pop him with a shadow ball. 
He is absolutely surfing right now. Ah, rude. Okay, so a crit of that would be 44. Oh. That's rude that it still hits me with hail afterwards. It's a wild Pokemon. Cut me the break. Alright, I do have to, unfortunately, heal Verboten if I'm going to keep Verboten up top. Because a crit from an arrow blast would probably kill a down health Verboten. Another war turtle! We've just leveled up, so now our Shadow Ball might kill. It did not kill. Uh, we'll Shadow Claw. Alright, another one down, folks. And now we're moving on to the trainers, who have Pokemon that are higher level than I do. We have not yet fought this guy. Uh, do we want Verboten up front against a trainer? Probably not, right? Done Vito up front. I dress light wherever I go. Yeah. <laughs> Developer Christine sent out Hippopotas. It's hand stream, right? No? Not until he evolves. Ah, there we go. No worries for Don Vito. That's helpful for Don Vito. He has his shorts on campus in the middle of winter guy, yeah. We all know a couple. An Umbreon. Uh, dark type. You know, we could switch. I don't really see the point. Leap Blade it. Wow, 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 wow. That's some defense, folks. But it is not some attack. We're gonna go for the Bone Meringue. The Bone Meringue might be sufficient to kill here. One. It's gonna be real close with the Sandstorm. Oh, crit! Hey, we got a crit, folks. Oh, uh, well, their Umbreon probably has zero Freytriarch. Extremely poggers, dude. A level 41 Zigzagoon. Is dead, folks. On to the next one. On to the friggin' next one, baby. Has uh, McRib not leveled up yet? Wow. That must be a tough Pokemon to level up. Good Pokemon, though. Clearly never been chased by a snapping turtle. New nightmare. What is uh, Torterra's item right now? A focus band? Screw that, dude. I'm not taking the potential odds on a focus band over a an amulet coin while I'm doing trainer battles on purpose. No way. Let's get some money. Slowest grow rate? Damn it. I've been skiing with Pokemon since I was just five years old. You should take a break. <laughs> That's a lot of years of skiing. Okay. Uh, tech <laughs> Technician Cami sent out Floatzel. In Pokemon Sword, they straight up tell you to buy an amulet coin, and then the very next route, you found an equivalent item. <laughs> Float Souls faster, does hit me with a brine. Not that much damage, because I have trained him for special defense effort values. You know I've trained him for those. 
and you know we'll one-shot this Floatzel. McRib! Through to level 35. That's three, three, two, 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 three. Very good. Buffeted by the hail. We're down to 99 health, and we're against a Staravia. Uh, you know... We could probably kill it with strength, but if we get aeroblasted, we're dead, so... We'll switch. We'll throw him a friggin' bone. Uh, Pokemon Trainer is like a fitness trainer. Is that how you got so good at Pokemon? How come you're going around killing Poke Trainers without even saying why? Yes, I'm the silent protagonist. I'm like, uh, uh, what the hell? How can I remem not remember the guy with the crowbar in Half-Life? Uh, Gordon Freeman. Uh, I'm like Gordon Freeman, but with Pokemon. Thank you, Streamlabs. Huh? What? I repeat. Huh? What? Dude, she's doing shtick. I'm not gonna spare... I, I'm gonna spare no expense right now. I just can't risk hitting like a level 44 legendary and not being able to swap to a Pokemon because they're down 30 HP. You're thinking of Morgan Freeman. I'm definitely thinking of Morgan Freeman when I think of the protagonist of Half-Life. Yeah. Really? <laughs> I would have thought for sure, but maybe I already did it last stream and I forgot. We skiers feel mother nature through the soles of our feet. I'd say that's probably the area you least feel mother nature due to the skis. Of all of the all of the areas you feel Mother Nature, uh, let's uh, probably Leaf Blade. Yeah, let's just do it. Be all right. That guy is skiing wrong. Okay, we're gonna switch. Very rude of Dusclops to do that. Thank God we did not get him to one HP here. Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to someone who's definitely faster, just in case. So we're gonna go to a nibble uh, because we don't want to go second after Destiny Bond. Rudest shit. Okay. This is scaring me a little bit. I can't risk hurting myself, really. Like, I can't risk, like, multiple turns of that, so. Ah, stop. Oh, I'm a little worried about this situation. Um. Because I might have to just take my odds if he confuses again. It doesn't kill me if it dies to weather? Okay, that's good. In such a world, I can afford to just use side beam here. Yeah, the hail is spooky, but that's good to know. We got him, folks, we side beamed him. All right, that was worrisome, but we did it. I think it's funny that this hail is bad enough to be hurting our Pokemon every few seconds and we're just having a battle. All right, we'll switch. 
too many too many variables here for me to calculate. It's just like, okay, he could crit, I could hurt myself, there's hail. I don't want to do the math. I just simply don't want to do the math. Uh, we'll switch to big here. Yeah, we got mirror coated. Just absolutely horrible. I didn't see what he used there. What did he use? Just in case he used something that I should know about. Was it... Roost? Okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs> I was looking at chat. I, I kill him. It's another Destiny Bond. <laughs> Tailo. Okay. Show him how it's done, Taylor. Oh, I got the crit. Okay, we'll be okay. Uh, let's just chatter, I guess. We'll be fine with a chatter. I don't want to keep missing. Pay attention, Phil. I was I was paying attention. I was just paying attention to the wrong thing. Or the right thing, depending on how you look at it. Freaking Gaga Guawa, dude. Psyducks are always saying Gaga Guawa. You can't stop them from saying it. So funky, that little riff there with the organ. You guys think that's an organ? I think it's an organ. That's me talking about the heart. <laughs> All right, yeah, we get it, we get it. It's yours to keep. I like your honesty. Let me reward you with an icicle plate. Dude, we're filling out our plates. We might have all of the plates, dude. Look at all of our plates, okay. We've got uh, Icicle. So we got Ice, Bug, Fighting, Steel, Ghost, Dark, Ground, Fire, elect uh, electric and poison, flying. We have 10 plates, dude. Uh, the plates, uh, they increase the power of those uh, moves and they also change uh, uh, Arceus's type and change Arceus's uh, judgment move. You can only use those plates when guests come over. There are several clans of ninjas. Are you from the Iga clan or Kuga? Is Kuga maybe a reference to Koga? From the original Pokemon games? That's what I think it is. Wow, a lot of flying types on this route. I don't want the flying type on my route. Uh, by route, I'm spelling it this time R-O-O-T, uh, my grass Pokemon that I'm switching out. That's what I'm saying. Uh, he has... Uh, we'll go over Boten, actually, because he has a really strong uh, normal move as well. Um, let's see. We'll go over Boten. Thank you, Praetor. Thank you. It's an arrow blast. See how it does. It. I'm not worried about it because it's weaker than a Salamence, but... Yeah. Okay, so that was 30 damage. Uh, if it crits, it'll be 60 damage. And I'll die to hail. Okay, so I take six from... I take six damage from hail right now. I guess I can't really hurt a Pidgeot with Verboten, can I? I just realized that. All right. Biffed a little bit, huh? Biffed it a little bit. All right, we'll switch to Charizard here. Uh, that does actually worry me, though. Um, I 
What's a Nibbles defense? Not as good as Verboten's, but special defense is similar. More HP. Big has way worse defense. Yeah, we can't switch to Big because a crit Brave Bird will kill. So we'll go a Nibble. It's good moves on this uh, on this Pidget. All right, 48, so a crit will be 96. Uh... I guess we heal again. I need to go get some more milk soon. I think maybe after this battle we go get some milk. A nibble's been carrying the team since it evolved. Yeah, it really has. She's she's uh, taking the. There, here's the move that I was worried about. Okay, 49. Um, you think we're faster than the pidget? Eighty-one? I don't think so. I mean, eventually Hale will kill it, and Brave Bird will kill it, um, between the two of them. The safe move is to do that. Wow, 52 that time. Alright, if he uses Brave Bird again, he, lo he dies. Uh... Thanks for the follow there, Kraken. You feel death in the air? Well, you feel Pidget's death in the air. There's no move that's more powerful than the ones that he's used. Mega Punch is much weaker. That gives us an opening to, uh, 30, uh, 900. 52, 100, uh, and four. I guess it could crit 104 and kill. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm just doing it. I'm staying safe. I'm spending the extra thousand. Sitting around making, waiting for the battle to end is making me antsy. I wish I had a Pidget spinner. <laughs> Got him. All right, one more hail turn for the safe victory very slowly. Sometimes you gotta take a nice slow victory. <laughs> Verboten should finish it. Let's get Verboten in there. Funny, because Crush Grip would do nothing to Verboten. Is the hail gonna get him this turn or is it gonna be another turn? Oh my lord. Another friggin' 5 hundo. All right, now we watch him go down regular speed. Can the hail crit? Wow. All right. Well, good news, we know it doesn't have charge beam anymore. Not a bad team here, particularly in the hail. You're absolutely right, Waxy Frenchie. We are just Skyrimming it right now. We haven't let the uh, uh, milk form curds yet, but we're doing the same thing. All right, no more. Time to face our fears. One shot. Ha 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 Elite Trainer Marshall! $656, oof. Not our best uh, performance there. $656. We spent probably about 
three thousand to that to four thousand on that fight. Maybe even more. All right, what's the newspaper fo folk want? Now, now. He wants to see a nose pass. That's correct, Praetor. I don't think we have a nose pass, right? We never caught one. We've just seen them. I don't even think we've seen them wild. Yeah, no nose pass. Uh, there is Will. Uh, you're trying to uh, become the champion of the Pokemon League, and then in some, you're also trying to complete the Pokedex. One dozen. It's of course 12 to the dozen. With the Moo Moo Milks. And you also have to stop the evil team's plans, that's true. Alright, should be enough milk. Just get four dozen milks real quick. Sometimes you gotta fly to another city to get four dozen milks. This camera should be more this way, right? and tilted down slightly. Can you catch void Pokemon for art scales in Fire Red for the EXP share? Uh, yeah, sure. Welcome back for 11 months in the bag today, Rory. Thanks for coming back. I appreciate it. Phil, Phil Scat Misson. Everybody's always raving about my s scat singing abilities. The people go wild when I bust out the syllables. Subscription. Protagonizzi. Thank you very much for the gift sub to Small Minds. Very from smuggle, technically illegal food for a profit to kidnap pets all the way up to literally destroy the universe. Yes. Yeah, create a new universe is where we are currently. Rib. Slowly getting that experience for our dragon, who has no effort values currently and still has very good stats. Yeah, this is great. This is good stuff here. Loving this. Bit. That's how it feels, Deffy. The the music does slap though. Technician Marshall. Badoo! That's the sound uh, that Mario makes when he jumps on a creature. Badoo. Uh, we're gonna strength the Badoo. I guess it's poison too, isn't it? So I could have used Bone Rush, and also it's a little bit risky because if he has a powerful uh, poison attack, it could be like a crit here with poison. Oh. 
I didn't realize its stats were that bad. Yeah, it just immediately sits down. Yeah, but Lou, they they also like explicitly are like on your side by the end. They're not. They're just like brash and rude. They 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 really toned down how bad the teams are. It's just like people who are a little like who who didn't show much empathy, you know. <laughs> It's like, ah, oh, these people aren't quite as uh, uh, aware of others' feelings as they could be, but you helped them learn it. Yeah, I thought they were fine. I did think that it was very, it was a very weird model to have everyone have. The character model for Team Yell. I thought it was a little too distinctive to have everyone look exactly like that. A Helix Fossil, folks! Another fossil! Very appropriate, the bad guy was a problematic fan base. That's funny. Elite trainer Leo sent out Beautifly. We will switch for Beautifly. To Big. Crush Grip! Wouldn't have guessed that. Wouldn't have guessed that move was coming down the pipes. Luckily, should be dead. There we go. Flyconic's time to shine. Didn't even die in regular speed. That's how not worried I was about that. That was its time to shine. That was, that was a good performance, honestly. It did 30 damage, so. I'll show you the techniques I had drummed into me at ski school. Very cute. Very cute. Let's bone meringue it. Dead. McRib grew to level 36. He learned to fight Pokemon at ski school? What were they doing? What are you doing over there? All right, grass flying. We'll get over to our friend, Big. A worry seed. I can't go to sleep, folks. <laughs> it's a powerful effect. Ski School 101. We only use the most adorable Pokemon. That's 18 months. Subscribe to the channel. A year and a half right here. Welcome back, Breezy. Hey, what's up? Just got back from Ski School. What are you learning over there? Some techniques? Oh no, you're prevented from experiencing one of the few hindrances in the game. Yeah, I get that it is like relevant maybe in competitive because you could replace people's abilities. Uh, I believe that's nine months, Rory. That's my favorite one, hands down. Nice. This is a little low. turn back time to hear it again. Well, I got good news for you. Other people will be subscribed for nine months at some point. Alakazam, folks. Uh, I think we go with a physical attack against Alakazam. Um, no, we switch to Verboten here. This MF showed up ready to eat some cereal and not just some cereal, a lot of cereal. Cross poison. Wouldn't have guessed it. In fact, I didn't guess it. Uh, okay, let's use Claw on him. Should be fine. 
Yeah, set a Google reminder to tune in two months from today. Uh, we'll do the Shadow Claw here. Role play and copied pressure. That would have been so funny if he copied uh, Insomnia. <laughs> the whole team is just built. It's a, it's a setup team. To, and it's like, oh, I got this great strat. I'm gonna give Alakazam Insomnia. <laughs> My techniques are rebuffed. Dude, I'll rebuff your techniques any day of the week. Ski school techniques. As if. Yeah, I don't mind the slowness of the uh, uh, HP bars. It's like, kind of lends itself. The one thing about the HP bars I don't like Dude, this guy's out of control. Look at him go, dude. He's out of control. He's sick with it. Uh, why would you repel Max? He's fun. I agree. Um, is that the orange is not... Uh, it's, it's above 50%. So if you get them to orange, sometimes you've only done 49% of their health. I think that's a bad idea. It should never be... Uh, it should never switch colors before you hit 50%. That's my personal take. Keyboard Cat, wow. Didn't the Keyboard Cat YouTube become the Means TV YouTube? Isn't that, isn't that something? Ah. I'm not sure that's true. Is it true? I think the YouTube channel got sold, or am I thinking, uh, maybe not Keyboard Cat, maybe I'm thinking of Nyan, I'm thinking of Nyan Cat. I think it was Nyan Cat that, went, that got turned into the Means TV YouTube. I haven't been keeping up with Keyboard Cat. Yeah, that's the thing. Nobody has. At a certain point, you gotta know when to sell. Buy low, sell high. All right, I think we've battled all the trainers on the route. I should have been keeping track of who had what so I could uh, potentially rebattle someone that I would want to rebattle. Uh... Is McRib really only gained two levels? Wow. That is slow. That is slow, folks. I like the way that feels when you enter this area. It feels so open because there's a full screen of white. Uh, but it's really not that open. There's really not that much area. I've already done everything, I think. This is the HM guy. Let me walk, dude. Come on. Oh, they get effort. They get like one, right? Like decreased. Twitch compression isn't totally barfing on this route, really. I mean, it's it's just a few pixels, right? End of the day. We're boating out here. War Turtle! Okay. Crab Hammer was a decent amount of damage, but he's dead. 
on the off chance that I encounter a Salamence in that one square of grass, we have to heal. All right. And now we can put uh, Don Vito back up top. Uh, we haven't gotten the gym yet, Sci Hobbit. I think the gym here is probably gonna be pretty tough because those trainers are all over leveled on me and I haven't even caught, like, like I haven't even caught up to those trainers yet. Uh, that's before the city with the gym in it. So it's like, I have a feeling, what what range of levels are this gym leader? I'm guessing they might, we might see a 50 here. The good news is the training here is very good and very fast. That's attack effort values, which is good for both of them. Um, Ludicolo is uh, probably special attack and speed, something like that. This is gonna be attack. Easy peasy, three attack. McRae leveled up and wants to learn Outrage, ooh. One twenty, one hundred. We gotta get rid of Tailwind. I just don't know how much I'm gonna be using it in a Nuzlocke, you know? It'll be last Pokemon only type stuff. Such a huge risk to use it any other time. Base game highest is 44, yeah, 48 or 49. I don't know if I did exactly a 10% increase. I might have done slightly more. Yay, Ludicolo! All right, another one down. Just leveling up right quick. Power Whip did decent damage there. Anybody else? Mirror B Retro Groove. What? Mamoswine. Another bunch of experience and effort values for us. Wait, what? I missed? Oh, he has evasion in the, okay. Sometimes he can have evasion in the hail, I guess. Okay, one more, five attack there, not bad. Makes sense too. Plus skin, hello. Gray alligator, goodbye. A quick fly back. Just leveling up real quick, you know how it is. For alligator is one of the coolest designs of this generation. Yeah, for alligators are very cool Pokemon. I think all of the Gen 2 starters are are good. Mirror B Retro Groove is a song that Ludicolo dances to in one of the spin-off games. Ah! That explains why I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know any of the spin-off games. I got Ring Fit Adventure when it was on sale this weekend. I think it's neat. It's neat. Get me doing a little bit of friggin' exercise, dude. Get me in the habit. You use that uh, mental uh, addiction I have to gaming to help myself exercise. It is definitely a little bit silly, yes. Uh, but you're, what you're basically looking for is is we fit, right? Exercise with it is pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. Get a bunch of get a bunch of squats in. Paula doesn't like squats. Played it for, uh, this morning for the first time in six months and you died? Yeah. Gamifying everything is the only way you can function. Definitely makes stuff easier.
Um, HP up. I'm going to use this on Verboten if I can. Nice. HP is good on Verboten. Zinc is special defense. We're going to use that on Doden Vito. Already, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, I guess we could use it on... Uh... Yeah, let's use it on McRib, even though, like... We wouldn't in competitive. Uh, defense. Yeah, whatever. Give me that dopamine for completing my silly little tasks. Exactly. McRib grew to level 38. Let's get him at least to 40, and then let's check out what's going on in the gym. I guess he could probably handle... Uh, no, he can't handle this route, because if he hits the ice... Whoa, Apollo. What was that noise? You want something over there? He begging? He being a bad little guy? Hell yes. Yeah, sometimes a that that sounded like a whining bark. It sounded like a like a begging bark to me. It says, "Come on, give me the treat, dude. What are you doing, hey buddy? Hey bud, is that what you were saying?" Saying it to me now? Thank Welcome you. back, Lady Yuck. 17 months with a tier 2 sub. Welcome back. How are you doing? That's, that's like a pretty solid sampling of effort values there. Wow. Wants to learn spikes? Nope. Keeping old moves instead of spikes. That's some pro Pokemon strats to share. Yeah, absolutely. Great. Thank you very much, Nasal Chaff, for 10 gifted subs. You just got a gift sub from Nasal Chaff. Hop on in the friggin' chat and say thank you. Oh, it's a party in here. It absolutely is. We just got a good smattering of effort values. Uh, one more training of in this manner should probably get McRib to level 40. Jingle sounds like uh, something from 90s Nickelodeon. Thank you. Thank you, Wizzle. That's right. All right. Mmm, McRib, strange pork shape. You're absolutely right, Lady Uck. I'm, I actually am kind of surprised that Verboten does not have max effort values. We've been using Mc Verboten a lot. I've trained it from like level 20 to 45 and was able to get more effort values right now. I am surprised about that. McRib's level 39, six attack in that level, up to 120 attack, folks. Pretty good level, particularly since we don't have a attack boosting item on him. There goes Mamoswine. There goes for Alligator. Should be an option to fight Pokemon with your bare hands. I still think that a simulation game where you are the bad guy, a la Team Rocket, would be an effective game. You're Giovanni, and you have to hire minions. We almost always 
get him to a shade with the leaf blade when it's Ludicolo. I have to milk this one. Well, a good a good bad guy does have some points. I feel like. You know? A well-written bad guy often has some points. Pretty good level right there. No disrespect to Bowser. To be fair, yes, I also like bad guys where it's just like they have no point. It's just obvious, like, like Sauron, you know? No points. Yeah, Palpatine just wanted peace and security in the galaxy. Is that such a bad thing? He loves democracy. He said it himself. There we go, McRib grew to level 40. 354232. Am I right, folks? All right, one more leaf blade to get rid of. And we're off, folks. You don't love the born evil narrative? I mean, you know, it's it can be all right. It can be all right. Yeah, well, actually, born evil no, but but like the the purely evil um, character, like the purely uh, uh, looking for power, looking for self, like that character can be okay too. Um, Born Evil gets into some weird stuff. You're right. Uh, all right, what do we got? We got uh, our highest level is now Don Vito. After that, um, let's I guess start with maybe big. Yeah, yeah, it has such implications. You're absolutely right. What's up, Shahan? Okay, but would you guys kill Hitler as a baby? Is this Jim's trick floor making you a little hot under the collar? If you can't maintain your cool in battle, you'll freeze up. A lot of, lot of stuff going on in that dialogue. Boss Bob sent out Zigzagoon. This guy's trying to make me dizzy with his Pokemon too. Am I right, folks? It's zigging and it's zagging. Counterpoint, I would fight any baby. It doesn't even have to be baby Hitler. Quagsire. And I will see you Quag later. <laughs> I tried very hard not to say quag later, and then I still said quag later. <laughs> Aqua ring. <laughs> I can't believe how how far the um, leaf blade animation fell. Level 46, by the way. Excellent joke, Phil. Top-notch stuff. Really continue to nail it every time. The, the thing that was best about that was how long I paused. That's why we come here. For material like this one. Wow, Tangle, you got some friggin' uh, defense or something? My duck, my friggin' god, dude. What the heck? Uh, yeah, I'll go big, lower level. Get some XP. What even is Tangela? It's a Tangle of Vines. It does, for some reason, also have shoes. Kirby wrapped up in vines. All right. Is anybody down any HP at all? No.
Oh, okay, I see. So you can't walk, you, you can only, okay, yeah. I could probably jump down this as well. It's t -t too cold. I c can't even feel my t tongue. Aren't you wearing like furs? Yeah, wh what? Did those not work? All right, ice flying, fire punch this guy. On brand though. On brand. A guy can't get chili? Cheers, Kames. I am now out of that. I'm gonna be making myself an iced coffee soon. A Wailord! Yeah, these Pokemon are pretty high level. If they're standing around in a big ice cube all day, the furs will only do so much. That's true. Aqua tail to aqua fail. Am I right, folks? I am right, by the way. I love how many cities are also built. I get that Pokemon training is huge, but like they're built around the gym. It's massive. It's, it's like the cultural institution. How long has he been out in the cold? All right, let's go past. Um, all right, so I wanna go here, here, here. And then fight this one. I've only been involved with Pokemon for a short time. I managed to get this far because skilled friends toughened me up. Granted, but they burned down your house to build it. Yes. Monkey's paw. Oh, wait. I already have them out. Monkey's paw. Monkey's paw. Monkey's paw. Monkey's paw. Defense, special defense, I missed. All right, guess we're going for the chatters instead. Septile is a reptile, not a raptor. It's right in the name, Septile. That's a crit, we love to see that. That's a level up. Three two two four two three. Not too shabby. Wants to learn Hyper Voice. Hyper Voice is ninety one hundred special. I suppose Chatter is also ninety one hundred special. Is there anything that normal hits that flying is, it doesn't do better against anything than flying? I don't think so, right? Flying is like strictly better than normal. Steel rock. Hits ghost. Pretty sure flying hits ground neutral as well. Um, levitators. Flying hits levitators. What? Okay, I'm gonna forget Hyper Voice. I don't think Hyper Voice is gonna be better than Chatter in any way. Funny that could have multiple moves that are just like making a bad noise. Yeah, the battler, I'm like sitting here like discussing it out loud. He's like, what are you doing? Um, I think Togetic's defense is a lot worse than their special defense. So we're gonna go with Fire Punch here. Might be the other way around. Guess we'll find out in a second. 
shatter. About the same. Zap cannon! Okay. Should be okay. That's because of Tailwind, isn't it? Okay, um... I am a little nervous about Togetic having a flying move. Yeah, but Zap Cannon does damage based on speed, doesn't it? Isn't it a Pikachu move? I guess it's verboten here. Aeroblast, wow. Fifty one. The speed boost is over. Once again, I switched to Verboten, not thinking about the fact that um, I can't hurt a normal type. So we're going to. Wow, that did more than half of my health this time. That must have been a very high roll. Okay, so we're gonna switch to a nibble in the assumption he's gonna use Aeroblast again, and then we're gonna hit him with a Surf. Okay. That was, that was scary, honestly. That was pretty scary. Um, we're still one more Pokemon to go though. Do we, I think we go to Verboten because almost none of Metacham's moves affect Verboten. Even though we're half health. Almost all fighting, all psychic don't affect Verboten at all. Yeah, we're okay there. I'm gonna heal just in case he has something weird. It's very true, Waxy. Mimic, okay. I guess there's an there's an outside chance that could have been bad. Um, but I'm afraid for this Metacham, it is dead, folks. We got through the battle. Again, a uh, little stressful with the higher levels. Um, McRib grew to level 41. Can't believe how tough you are. Push that. Oh. This Metacham needs a medic. Ham! Yeah, conservation of momentum. My willpower was shaped and tempered by howling blizzards. I'll bring it to bear on you. Which bear? <laughs> Yogi? All right. That's Yogi Bear. Uh. Yogi Bear. No, yeah. No, I'm right. 48. All right. Water sport. Not water spout. Dunzo. I guess at this point, McRib is pretty much not needing the XP share anymore, but. To have a little more momentum, I guess, to do that one. Uh, 
We'll show it's how we'll show you how it's toughened us up. Boss Wayne sent out Bronzor. That's true, lady. Yep. Whether you like it or not. Boom, baby, got the crit. Charizard's doing some good critting. Smashed in those walls and then stood still. Yes, correct. Unless they have some special shoe. Standard issue shoe from the gym. This is a useless area, huh? I guess probably this clears something. Nope. Um, have I fought all the trainers? That's what I'm wondering right now. Because I think I do need to um, battle a little bit more. You know what I'm talking about? Battle! Mario Kart 64 and also probably other Mario Karts, but that's the one I'm thinking of. Yeah, crashing the wall to stop. That's exactly what you want to do when you're skating. It's very good advice. Here. Get rid of all those. Probably there's something over here that I can do now. Oh, I can do this. Um, okay, I'll have to do this all again though, right? Now that I've biffed. Well, not I haven't biffed anything, but. Have I fought this one? I don't know if I fought this person. I guess in order to fight that person, I'm gonna need to... Go here, and then here, and here. Nope. Oh, don't worry, I'm not done with the floor puzzle. I just have to, oh, I have to get up there and then down, okay. Okay, I'm done with the floor puzzle. <laughs> oh, I already, I already did, okay. Um, I don't think I'm comfortable fighting a person with who has level 48 shit right now. I think I need to kill some more dudes on this route. You know, I'm sure it will be fine, I'm not. I see your I'm sure it will be fine, and I'll raise you, I'm not. Yeah, I mean, we don't have to necessarily worry about ice because it is randomized, but, um. I guess we may as well use Silver Wind, it's equally strong. Plus, we might get a stat raise. All right, can't really take more than one fight there with Verboten. Not ideal. Uh, let's switch over to McRib and switch away if it's a ice type to a nibble, I suppose. Uh, will I stream any of the new Pokemon games? I may. I may. Give McRib a sharp beak. Uh, but the thing is, I'm playing that generation right now, so it feels a little weird to um, just switch over to the same generation. You know what I mean? Air Blast. Right, Mammoth Swine, we cannot handle. Even if we have cut its attack, we'll go to a nibble. And then we will 
will surf it to death. I wouldn't be surprised to find a sharp beak on McRib me either. What's up, Winter Melon? Glad to have you. Yeah, the next the next Nintendo game I'm gonna stream is on gonna be on Tuesdays. I'm gonna play uh, uh, Link's Awakening. Seems like a downgrade from Platinum, from what you can tell. Some people have said they really like it. Some people have said they don't at all, so. Zelda time. As far as Pokemon Sundays goes, I'm not sure what's after this, um, or if we'll take a break from Pokemon Sundays. We've done a lot of Pokemon Sundays, you know? Uh, remake of the remake? What do you mean remake of the remake? There's multiple remakes? Uh, Outrage should be fine. I guess not. All right, level 42 there. Original was your first game ever. It was Link's Awakening DX. Yeah, but that wasn't a remake. That was just additional content for the Game Boy Color if it was played in the Game Boy Color. So, if you're gonna come at me here in the stream, you better know precisely what you mean. I've got... I'm gonna Bray Bird him and then I'll head back for some heals. I guess Big doesn't really fulfill a super powerful fire user right now. Um, I count it as a remake, so you're wrong. Source, I want you to be wrong. <laughs> it's a good source. I use it a lot for my personal debates. I would consider that like an early version of DLC, you know? But similarly, it was one of my first video games and it was definitely the first game I beat multiple times. Um, I remember I played it, I, I got sick and I played it through in a day once. Um, but it's been a long time since I played it, so I don't really remember much about it. It's a weird one, but I love it. That's the thing, though. When when it was just, like, a little bit more chill game, like, it's just like, oh, well, this is what we could do. Let's make a boss based on this. Why not? That's kind of how it felt. You know what I mean? Couldn't beat it because it was in French and I couldn't find out what the ghost was telling me. Yeah, sometimes instructions in video games are important. Wow. Dude bone rushed me. Alright, he avoided the attack. Almost just lost a nibble in hyperspeed because he hit like five hit bone rushes and I missed a surf. That was a little bit spooky. Digimon or Yu-Gi-Oh or Yokai Watch? What's Yokai Watch? Outrage. It's like Pokemon, but there's a watch. A nibble nearly went to hell. You're absolutely right. That was a that was a scary moment right there. It was supposed to be an easy moment. Five more attack. Draco Meteor! Um, I think I keep Spatial Rend over Draco Meteor. 95 accuracy instead and high crit, crit ratio. For my special dragon attack, I think I keep Spatial Rend. I can use it multiple times. It has higher accuracy. Um, yeah. About the same power if you account for the crit ratio. So, Draco Meteor is getting cut. 
We know McRib is a brave bird. We don't need a move to tell us that. It's a modern take on Pokemon that leads more into Japanese mythology. Nice. Yeah, I know. I know that they're definitely like based on on uh, yokai, right? Aurora Beam. All right. Just hit him with a Surf here. A Nibble leveled up. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Another level. Level 43, level 43, 42, 46, 41. What do you think, folks? Do you think we're good? Lost a Pokemon while grinding? Not this run, Innsmouth. <laughs> Not this run. But uh, we lost Ligma, like, very early to a Lanoon that used Mega Kick and Crit, if I remember correctly. It was just a surprise Mega Kick Crit in like Viridian City in the Fire Red run. The very first highlight I believe has that. Um. What do you think guys? One, one more, one more train? One more training thing? Yeah, let's save real quick. Good idea. Gaga, gua, wa, want your bed romance. I think we train um, using the rest of our Aeroblast here or whatever. Um, slash switches to um, a nibble. And then we put um, Don Vito in, use up all of the leaf blades, and then we switch. And we, and we put the EXP share on Verboten when we switch Don Vito in. I think that's a good good uh, plan. What do you guys think? I agree, guys. Need crickets on your soundboard, I really do. Did someone say ga ga gu wa wa? No, they said Psyduck. So now, I'm done Vito, back up here, we're boating. Wish you could just hit up to go to the bottom. I have a cat on my lap reaching over to type, I agree, you disturb, sir. You're forgiven. This one particular uh, instance. Hard to know how it'll go because it's randomized, but I, I don't know. I believe in you, Phil Jameson. Thank you. We're just, we're just sprinting through some Pokemon real quick. What are we, in line at the Pokemon bank? Because we're sprinting through some Pokemon. Are we, are we, um, ah, oh boy. I missed, uh, I got hit by Icy Wind. We're okay. Okay, we're okay now. That was uh, very bad luck is what happened there, Waxy Frenchie. Um, luckily, not quite bad enough luck to fully die and lose, but very, very bad luck.
Uh, Sci Hobbit, we're thinking about it, but also it's one of our strongest Pokemon and I don't know if we can really afford to get rid of it. All right. I think we, uh, go for it. What do you guys think? 46, 46, 43, 42, 44, 41. I'm a little low for sure, but it is randomized. Um, you know, what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop that immediately. Gym leader gonna have four Badu? Certainly possible. It's not impossible. All right, so we have uh, one more and we have to get, for the one more, we have to get over there, which is easy enough. Paul is cheering me on, you're absolutely right. He always is. That's why he's so good. Let's just go back this way. <sighs> All right, there we go. Folks, let's fight the gym leader. We'll lead off with, I think, Don Vito. Pretty solid start. Um, could also lead with McRib, arrow blasting. This puzzle soft locks so many people in the remakes. Yeah, it like, cause you could move di multiple directions, right? Yeah, Verboten is slow. Um, and that is why we're gonna re-give Verboten the quick claw instead of the EXP share. All right, folks. Good luck to us. You wanna challenge Candace? Sure thing, I was waiting for someone tough, but I should tell you, I'm tough because I know how to focus. Pokemon, fashion, romance, it's all about focus. I'll show you just what I mean. Get ready to lose. Mark. Four Pokemon. Rich Kid Mark sent out Hippowdon. All right, great matchup here, fantastic matchup with fantastic effect for us. We've got a sandstorm going with a ground type in play. One down, maybe. Probably one down. Not quite. What was that? I assume it's a ghost two turn move. Sh Phantom force. What is the uh, power on that? What's what's it do? <laughs> Hippo force. I mean, I guess let's just put a uh, X defend on him, right? since we're faster, so. Otherwise, we're just missing an attack for free. Yeah. Leaf Blade. All right, one down, folks. Uh, yes, I think so. Let me grab my keys. Or it just produces sand. It's just uh, magic sand. Sometimes there's magic sand. That does occur. In real life as well. That hippo was hungry. For death. A Pidgey! You know, we have raised attack, or raised defense. Yeah. 
It's a Pidgey, and we have Raised Defense. Sharpen. Pidgey just sharpened itself. I am curious about the mechanics of the Pidgey sharpening itself. That's correct, Spice Slicer. That's correct. Yeah, this Pidgey is setting up. Um, unfortunately, the Pidgey is uh, just setting up its funeral. It's like writing its will. Yeah, sharpening its claws and beak, yeah. Viable, viable. Radicate, um, we're gonna hit him with a leaf blade. Horn drill. That was liter I have to switch to verboten here because I need to. That's cap. That's cap. That's cap. That's cap. It's legit cap. That's cap. Well, actually, Frenchy, it's legit cap. I have to switch to verboten here because I need to be immune to horn drill, or else I'm going to lose my team probably. Um. So let's silver Windham. Wow, that's a good Radicate right there. Um. What is Rock Wrecker exactly? Oh, it's a recharge ability. Okay, I didn't know that. Okay. Uh, let's get him with a Silver Wind again. <laughs> You're critting. Right now, Eradicate on Verboten, beloved. All right, Toxic Couch has to one-hit KO him. Yeah, Anticipation made it shudder, but don't worry, he has to recharge. Okay. That's cap, that's cap, that's cap, That'll get him. That's cap, that's cap, that's cap, that's cap. It is cap, Lou, you're absolutely right. Okay, one left, folks. Oh, that was cap. Horn drill, guys. And if we just trained more, that literally couldn't have killed him. <laughs> and Gibble! Okay. I'm gonna break the ice and bring out my last resort Pokemon. Well, I think we know what your last resort Pokemon was. Um... This one has Fisher, dude. I have to switch away from Gibble because it has a 30% chance of hitting Toxicouch. The only Pokemon that has no chance of being hit is a Nibble, so we have to go to a Nibble. It's apparently the one-hit KO gym. My lord. Thank you for the gift sub there. I <laughs> All right, we'll go for the surf here. I'll do my best, Sci Hobbit. It's not very effective, but two of them should get him. All right, we got him. Okay. Oof. All right. You've warmed up to me. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You earned my respect. Icicle badge. 
one clip fills, this will be fine before he went in. TM72. Heel Bell, thank you. Thank you for Heel Bell. And I'll be in hell after that gym. Radicate was indeed viable. Yes, that Radicate, uh... Did, did some work. All right, there goes Don Vito into hell. <laughs> this, this box, wow. This is some box right here. And Verboten really did do well for us. Um, but is now in hell. Verboten does hurt. Verboten was a nice zone candidate. Recently. We were recently like, should we take uh, Mama's Wine instead of Verboten? All right, so we're taking Mama's Wine in return for uh, Don Vito. Uh, do we take Pizza Rat again? Do we take our Spookian? For dark typing again? Because we have no dark typing now. I think we take Spookian. Well, we've got our ground type with uh, our ice ground now. I don't think we take Earth Maul. I don't think we take Earth Maul. Yeah, but Prick Cheney is, is... Yeah, it does have grass, I guess. Doesn't have, doesn't have... Either way, we're training a weak Pokemon right now. Take that awful weather thing and send it to hell to keep promoting company. The nice zone is where our heroes go, Praetor. Well, Spookian sucks right now, Waxy, but, but um, Drapion is a very good Pokemon and it has battle armor. Already, already Spookian's speed and defense are higher than um, Prick Cheney, which are what you care about at the low levels. I think I would rather have this Pokemon. And, I, and as a result, I'm going to take this Pokemon. Um, okay, so first things first, we're going to put the EXP share actually on... Uh, Mama's Wine, because we want to get Mama's Wine up to, up to, like, usability as quickly as possible. Very nice, Duffy. Uh, and then, did I take Verboten's item off? I did, indeed. I'll put a focus, I don't know, sash, I guess, on, uh, Spookian. because that way, if I need just one HP out of Spooky and I can take it. A Nibble is a, is a Psyduck, so. I guess I haven't looked up here. What's up here? Would you like to hear a trendy saying? Fractals, okay. I don't have enough shards. There's like a lot of shards. Force palm? Spookian has uh, plot armor. That'd be a good ability. Oh, what's this? Oh, is this that temple? Only the chosen. All right. Guess I'm not the chosen yet. Probably once you beat the uh, stuff. I cannot go underground, Praetor. My DS does not have Wi-Fi capabilities. <laughs> I was like, I do? What are you gonna give me? Ah, a Stantler. It is a Stantler, yeah. No, you can't, Praetor.
Think about it, the Stantler will level faster. It will also be a Stantler, which I have. Um, I guess we go McRib up front again. All right, I gotta level up What's-His-Face a couple times. I also have to teach Rock Climb to somebody now. As well as potentially Defog and uh, Strength, which I no longer have on any Pokemon. Dupes, yeah. So I have to I have to just tell her, oh sorry, that's actually dupes. Can you send me a different Pokemon? <laughs> you know, that's just that's just dupes. Go to a nibble here. Drink some water, I'll get you some water. Let me go grab some water. Cheers, sweet tape. I believe money bag started with like ten thousand. Chair stream, chair stream. live in a circle. Boy, training is not very fast, is it? Even with these, like, pretty good... Like, Mama's Wine hasn't even leveled up once. I guess I haven't been doing it for very long, have I? I'm impatient. Come on, come on, come on. Get a couple levels. Oh boy, that was a tough loss, huh? Good, good, good stats, good stats. Good thing we can tap the side of the DS to speed things up, absolutely. Bum, 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 bum. Uh, we're not gonna be losing a nibble right now to five crits from a bone rush, so we keep doing that whenever need be. Horn drill, guys. You never really expect horn drill, do you? The funny thing is, I could have easily lost uh, another Pokemon to Fisher there. We were not, like, far away from losing another Pokemon to Fisher. Is the route east of Lake Valor still closed? Are there strong trainers? Um, I have to go... Next thing I have to do is go to this lake near here. There might be trainers there, but... I just lost some Pokemon. I'm only running with really four Pokemon right now. So I have to get at least up to five with uh, Mama's Wine getting some experience here. Once that happens, then I'll feel comfortable um, like checking out more trainers. Um, so the game breaking, the game breaking moves, the one hit KOs and the Dragon Rages and stuff, I think they're only off until like, um, like move thir or, or level 30 or something. 
like to the point where you should be able to deal with them. Six attack, not too shabby, McRib. Well, they're tough in, in Nuzlocke runs is the big thing. Uh, Dragon Rage is game breaking also in in early parts of the game because it does 40 HP, which is more than most Pokemon have. So it's just all falls under the bubble of game breaking moves, even if it's not all really game breaking. All right, Mama's Wine. Is that true? Okay. Yeah, I guess that would be why then. Boy, the, the, <laughs> yeah, the training is not fast, is it? That's all right, we'll get, Spooky and involves level 40, right? We probably do, SmackDown. Spooky and 40, okay. Well, he'll level up a lot faster than Mamoswine will. I assume Mamoswine is slowest. And Spooky and is probably pr pretty fast. Pretty good, but pretty much just a visual upgrade. Nice five hitter. Love a good five hit bone rush on my uh, dude every time. All right, here we go. Got ourselves a nice Ludicolo. Dunzolo. <laughs> nice, Phil, thank you. Uh, over to a nibble. Aurora beam, nice, that's what we'd love to see. I do find it interesting also that the Mamoswine sometimes uses Bone Rush against uh, Salamence when he has access to ice moves. But I guess wild Pokemon are not very smart, huh? Or they're very, very smart. Is the Gaga Guawa still in the new versions? Oh yeah, you bet it is. Cool. Nice five hitter with a crit in it. luck on these Mamoswines. I might start using Bone Rush more, even though it's not a very good move. <laughs> Fairly hits five times most of the time. For Alligator, level 35. That should be a one-shot nowadays. Ludicolo is a one shot. Six attack, five special defense. We love to see it. Mama's wine is getting there. Moving on out. A couple more, and we'll have Mama's wine up at level 40, and then we can move to trainers, I think, even though level 40 is a little low.
Yeah, the 10% bump really does slow down the action in the stream, doesn't it? The 10% bump makes it impossible. Cause if I just, if I try to go to the next trainer, I will lose. Um, like without training. Um, Yeah, having a name raider and a move forgetter and like all that stuff in every uh, Pokemon Center was definitely a good idea. Four hits there. to be careful with that. Doing a great job with the stream spacing, but it's a bit rough at times. It really, it really is tough at times. I'm doing my best to try to like keep, keep it going, you know, keep the patter going. Really at this point, these sections are more, let's all hang out for a bit. That's really what we're doing right now. It's not the most engaging visually, but we're hanging out still. And at the end of the day, isn't that what it's all about? What are the stats for Rock Climb? Is it a good move? I think it's like 85 accuracy with decent power, if I remember correctly. So the answer is no, it's not a good move. We might be able to outrage the, the Ludicolos. We might need to run back every time we run out of the Met at this point. See what happens. Hanging out is cool. Also chilling, kicking it, all very cool. Yeah, we can outrage them. Bad HMs are so frustrating. Defog makes me want to tear my eyes out. <laughs> right, this is this is good. Not knowing that we can outrage them too. If I weren't afraid of Ice Fang crits, we would, could even outrage the Mamoswines. But I'm sure an, out, an Ice Fang crit would kill the crib. Level 39, nice. Almost there, folks. I think McRib should take a shell bell, probably, right? Six more attack, dude. Whew. Yeah, that's that's smart. That's a smart improvement to not have to worry about HMs. It's it's such a common sense one too. Like, I I get why the design choice was made initially. Um, given what like game ideology was back then. But at this point, come on. Three more. Da -da -da. We'll just go back one more time. I do think, interestingly, our Charizard, our Big, is is probably the weak spot on the team right now. Between uh, Big and Toxicouch. Toxicouch does have a like a use case though that's pretty good. Big feels kind of weak. Um, excuse me? Um, I think that you get a headset and sword that you can change down individual settings. Right? Like in one of the cities, they give you that. Toxic is a nasty little freak and I don't want them to leave. Uh, 
I love our nice, uh, just... There we go. Level 40 are completely, uh, uh... What's the word? Starts with an A. It means there's no rhyme or reason to it. It was just... Am, it's, it's like am, it's close to ambiguous. I always mix it up with the word ambiguous, and then I think for about 26 seconds, not as I know, are, are completely arbitrary. There we go, arbitrary. Those two are like right next to each other in my brain. Ice Punch. I do like to hear Ice Punch. Ice Punch is 75,100. Ice Fang is 65,95. Aurora Beam is 65,100. Special. We'll get rid of Mist. A more interesting Pokemon, dragons are lame. Big isn't a dragon? Out of your mind? It's a, it's a fire flyer. All right, we're gonna give uh, the EXP share to our Spookian and begin that, that uh, training process. Give Mama's Wine a... Never melt ice. All right, let's uh, heal up. Um, finish one more training phase and then we're off to the next part of the game, folks. Get a little experience here. Get spooky and start start leveling up a couple times and then we can start fighting some more team galactic members who might start killing some of our dudes because we're probably going a little bit too quick but that's okay folks sometimes you got to make decisions <laughs> based in entertainment rather than logic baby after all what's the worst that could happen Sometimes when you see the stats of an unevolved Pokemon at level 20 with no effort values, you're like, oh, what the heck? Why am I training this one? But then you remember what's going on. What I don't like is how they took out the fast forward feature. Well, that, that didn't come. It's just my particular DS that has it, so. A nibble grew to level 47. Spooking grew to level 23. He wants to learn sludge. Nice. I'll take sludge. Take sludge over cotton spore. You know I will. Useful move. Remember when we did this training with Don Vito? I remember. He's our highest level Pokemon. But he was one level too low. It has been really interesting to see all the different Pokemon. Who's Don Vito? That's what hell is, people forgetting that you existed. Already level 24 on Spookian. Nine attack that level! Wow! That's what, uh, training on three attack effort values like for Alligator and, uh, the ice guy, Mamoswine are. Why did I switch? Why did I do that? That could have been bad. That was, that was, I autopiloted that. I gotta be careful. I 
could have been bad for a nibble. It wasn't, but it could have been. Level 25. This is when I switch. Froze me, come on. It's a burn. There we go. Have a berry. That way you'll not be frozen solid anymore. That berry is just made of flame. Very, very warm berry. This route does actually rule. It's, it's, I mean, it's, it, it's a great place to train. Particularly the Pokemon that I am training, like mostly attack effort values with a little bit of special attack effort value. Does Ludicolo give speed too? Or is it just special attack? a berry in the middle of your multi-hit move. That's funny. Stopping your fury swipe. Good old fury swipe. Spooky and grew to level 27. I'm already up to 54 defense on Spooky and which is nice. Pre-evolution. All right. Three special defense. Oh, that's why he's getting good special defense. That's awesome. I'm very glad to hear that. All right, now that we have a couple new Pokemon also, take a look at um, Zen Headbutt real quick because we still don't have any psychic moves. Spookian can learn it. That's awesome. That'll be great. Oops. Um, take a look at Judgment. Still only Toxic Couch and Aura Sphere, which probably I won't be using, but yeah, it can only go on the same people. Okay. Let's take a look at Rock Climb, folks. Rock Climb, 90 power, 85 accuracy. And of course, another TM, or, or another HM, Rock Climb, for whatever reason, has the word rock in it. Just like Rock Smash, everybody's assuming it's a rock move. There are multiple rock moves that have the word rock in them. Neither of these moves are a rock move. Rock Smash is fighting and Rock Climb is normal. Uh, I guess we give it to Spookian for now. This horrible, horrible move. Get rid of uh, Pin Missile. Rock climbing is a normal hobby. I don't see why you're confused, Phil. <coughs> wow, Apollo. We have opinions on that too, huh? Um, let's give uh, Mama's Wine strength as well. Let's give Mama's Wine strength instead of Aurora Beam. Wow, Apollo. It's a bit much, bud. That is a bit much. You were just asleep, dude. What are you doing? Wow. Dude's got opinions. Oh, there's vacuum cleaner. He hears a vacuum cleaner. 
that's what's going on. Understood. I don't forgive it, but I understand it. The wall is very rocky. Would you like to use rock climb? A lax incense. It's a barky baby today. Yeah, absolutely. Apollo is being a very barky baby today. Right, here's the uh, lake. Let's hope we're not making a big mistake. You're not getting away with this Team Galactic. Are you finished already? Your Pokemon are bad, but you're laughably weak. You honestly thought you could save the Pokemon of the lake and become the Pokemon champion? Dream on, little kid, but ew, it's so cold here. Let's go back to the Veilstone HQ. Don't I know you? We met. We're gonna do something huge. That's why you should keep out of our way. I just don't try to stop this person. God, I'm stupid. Uxie was suffering. No! I'm gonna get tougher. It's not about winning or losing. That's not good enough. I have to be stronger. It's not enough. Just want to be the most powerful trainer. It takes honest effort and determined heart. I did. Alright, so that's the lakefront. This is Lake Acuity, so I can indeed catch here, folks. It'll be very funny when I just wasted a bunch of time. Well, not really, because I was still getting experience for someone. Does anybody have a status effect? I have to keep, I, I can't keep track of my Pokemon. They're always dying. Um, answer's probably not. We'll go a nibble up top. The only Pokemon we can catch at Lake Acuity is Kate, that is so funny. All right, let's just quick ball it. Oh my God. So goofy. It's Eradicate doing in a lake? Swimming. All right, Eradicate was caught folks. Yeah, baby! It whittles its constantly growing fangs by gnawing on hard things. It can chew apart cinder walls. Give a nickname, Wet Rat. Home. It will eventually know Horn Drill if it didn't already. What a rat. Normal rat. Gaga Guawa. Topper scent. Drill. Wint. Nawawa. Way too many characters, I'm afraid, but yeah. Winter Drill is good. That dex description was describing real IRL rodents. Yep, that's true. Looks like Drill is winning on account of the horn drill move that it used to kill one of our Pokemon in the gym. Drill, the Raticate. Song kind of slaps. Uh, 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 uh. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm here in the cave with mama's wine. I am training those stats. I am feeling fine. I'm gonna give him the, uh, give her the... Anklet? I think we want some, I think we want some speed probably. It's a good song. It's a very good song. We'll kill Raticase and get some speed while we're at it. Uh, what's over here? Oh, there's grass over here too. Is there more up here? I didn't realize. Huh. 
Um... A shelter. All right. Level, level 38 shelter. Sunny day, folks. Put that on cast form. Check over in the corner. Radicate. Radicate. Frustration. Doing decent damage. Oh, whoops, wrong ability. Horn drill can't hurt me. Roost. Dude, Radicate's moveset is nuts. Eradicate's moveset is straight up good. A frozen lake full of rats. We should use our Eradicate. We shouldn't. We shouldn't. But its moveset is nuts. All right. We got, you know, 20 speed EVs there. Let's get back to Never Melt Ice. Absolutely busted Radicate. Let's go take a look at Radicate. Level 21 Radicate. All right, I took uh, named Drill. 51 speed. <laughs> Kind of stick speed. Jolly nature. Ero <laughs> this rat, oh my God. Fake tears into eruption, dude. No, we're not putting Radicate on the team, dude. His special attack is 28. I'm not. <laughs> oh my God. Don't make that rat angry, dude. She's kind of sick with it. It's good. Don't worry. They'll end up on the team after we lose a bunch more Pokemon. Um. All right, uh, I guess. Hi, Apollo. Hi, buddy. You wanna say hello? Is that what's up? Okay, I'll let you say hello. You're being very sweet and nice. Come here, bud. Could you give me a couple milk bones? Oh, hi, buddy. You wanna lie right there? That's so cute. Yeah, cute little guy. Let's say hello to Apollo, please, chat. Good boy. There he is. Good little guy. He's getting to be a better little guy. He's still barking, as you can tell. We're working on it. He's getting better. Aren't you, buddy? All right, buddy, relax there. That's a command. We'll see if he does. He just has strong opinions on Pokemon. Phil, did you know there's a dog laying next to you? In game? All right, uh... So I guess I can go this way now, um, I assume. I'd be surprised if I couldn't, honestly. That is so nice. Let me grab my keys. What kind of dog was it?
Did I do everything up here? I'm just trying to think. Or am I supposed to go to Verity? We've already done Verity, right? Oh, they said, they said, yeah, go to the Veilstone, right? Okay, HQ. Canonically, Apollo is a good boy. It's true. Um, all right, so warehouse. It's you. I bet you don't remember me, but I sure remember you because of you. They took my Clefairy away. My partner called it quits and went back to his old country. Why? I know nothing. I don't know anything about any storage key. It's Looker, dude. Very good, buddy. I have the storage key. The warehouse. Dude, am I gonna double battle with Looker? I hope he has some cherries. Oh, item. That's right, there's other items south as well. Let me go get those other items while I'm at it. Who is this guy? He's a member of the International Police. Canonically. Praetor. That is who that person is. Remember when the Raticate used Rock Wrecker and destroyed my... destroyed Verboten in one shot because he crit? That sucked. I don't know what was worse, that or the horn drill. The horn drill was also pretty rough. All right, let's get her her hotel key, right? That's right. I have to assume that eradicate kids. Wait, there's nothing here? Wild. Oh, there it is. Okay. I didn't see the rocks there. They're so tiny, the pixels. Kind of sick with it. Remember when the same Raticate used Horn Drill and killed Don Vito? Yeah, but Don Vito, like, great Pokemon that we we did. I'm not saying anything, nothing against Don Vito, but Apollo, where are you going? Uh, Don Vito, hidden power. That could be good. We don't. There's there's someone in this game who tells you what hidden power would be, right? I thought that was gonna be her key. I guess I have to find her key somewhere else. Unless it randomized her key away, in which case. We are not gonna do that. I don't think it would randomize key items, though. <laughs> key items. There you go, buddy. Did she say something else yet? Uh, would it be easy to find? when you left the reception counter. I guess the reception counter's here, huh? I literally was 100% sure that it was a, uh, it was a puzzle over there. Um, just pick those items up over there. And so I ignored this this whole time. Hey, buddy, don't get over there. Go over there. Go see mom, bud. Good boy.
A white flute, guys! Dude, we got so many flutes. We got so many friggin' flutes, dude. So many flutes. Freaking Gaga Guawa. Yeah, we have two white flutes, four red flutes. This guy's instincts tell him there's something good up here. Okay. Well, there is Mr. Mime up here, so he's not wrong. Fake tears, folks. Oh, there can be items in solid grass. Another Firestone, folks. Spooky and Gritter level 28. Bug Buzz. That's a pretty good move, right? 90, 100. Special attack, but better than 20, 100, even if my attack is much lower. Can't read my, can't read my. No, he can't read my guawa face. Uh, okay, so I guess we gotta go deal with Team Galactic now and then the uh, blackout will magically be done. I think there's an item over here too that I could rock climb to. Yeah. What a bizarre little thing that they've done here. The only way to get to some of our homes is to do rock climbing. This is an on-purpose resort village. Coin toss? Guys, I have a feeling this app might come in handy. This app might come in handy, the old Coin Toss app. Nice full incense. All right, let's go back, surf to the right, move up those rock climbing things. Oh, I don't need to do that. I could just go here. And then I could surf to get back. What's here, though? First, assume an item is up here. Although, we do need Dowsing Machine pretty much all the time, but... Another Never Melt Ice, dude! Non-stop with it. Coin Toss app is very Web 3. All right, Slonkin. Thanks for coming by, bud. See you on the VOD channel. Wait, which one is... Okay, now we can just do that. Which one is... Uh... Six, right? Six is dousing machine, excellent. Nope. Seven is dousing machine. Mighty Ina. We're like, die, die, Tina. Dying, folks. Roasted. I guess frozen, more so. Doubt I can get over there right now, but worth a quick check. See, always worth a quick check, folks. Hi, Wave Riding Trainer. How about a battle? On the sea! That's a, oh, it's a floating. Okay. 
Arcanine level 34. I could use a ground attack, but I'm going to be safe. Wow, level 39 there. This is, this is a great spot to train, actually, guys. Happened upon a great spot to train. They're just in the range that Mama's Wine will be strong against them. Dude, friggin' slaps. Dude's a freaking ghost. <laughs> All right, Cherubai. It's friggin' revenge time, dude. Oh my lord. Oh, the cherries, dude. Get rid of these cherries. Goldine, Goldine. And man, Tyke. And Tyke survived his strength, and a crit would have brought me to like 20 HP. Is that true, Lou? Oh my god! Dude. Wait, I can get up here too? Oh my god, so tricky. This area is like designed to make you think you can't get through there, but you can. It rewards willpower and diligence. I love how the sailors are like, wow, 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 wow. And then the swimmers are like, I'm going swimming, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very different vibes if you're on a boat or in the water. Mama's Wine. I think I might start saying this like uh, Star Wars name as well. Mama Sween. <laughs> Doesn't work. Dude, it's a Stantler. I could have had one of these. So could have they if they didn't fight me. Five attack, baby. Which Pokemon's number 69? I, I definitely know 420 now. I'll never forget 420. <laughs> Bellsprout? I don't think I like that. Oh! Uh, we're gonna go over to uh, Toxic Couch for this particular one. Ember! Does he not have any rock moves? Bell Sprout, Bell Sprout, Bell Sprout. That's a rude thing to do, but. Pain Split followed by Vacuum Wave. I have no idea what Vacuum Wave is. What is Vacuum Wave? It's Cherubai, Government Pants. So I was funny in the comments on the highlights when I said I was high on Pot Noose and couldn't figure out why the Cherubai was sandbagging you in the doubles. Special 40 base power priority. F oh, okay. Quick attack, special fighting. Okay. Thank you. Vacuum wave <laughs> is when they <laughs> you have it fill a stadium with loyal Dyson fans, and then they take turns standing up, and it looks like a wave. Breeder Thomas. What's saltier, my tears or the sea? I don't know. Sorry about your Pokemon. All right. <laughs> Random items are very funny sometimes.
A very secret area. Hey, it's a boom box. More like a doom box. He's doomed. He's dead. Secret item? No. I don't think I can get past that there. Yeah, I can. Okay. I just can't get back. Why is this here? No items, but... This has to be something that I'm just not familiar with. Is that like an event of some kind here sometimes? Like a mystery gift type thing? Go to this island or... Oh, this is my favorite. Goes up every time it's purchased. Spookian's level 30, folks. We're getting there. Slow and steady wins the race. The mighty Ina lowered my attack and I did not kill him in one. Can't get under there. Wait, wait. You at the soup store? What kind of soup you getting? Minestrone Superior. Combination soup and store. What's my favorite soup? My favorite soup is probably uh, chicken avalemino. Got any chicken avalemino stands in the house? Where are my chicken avalemino stands? Absolute fools in the chat right now. It's egg lemon soup. It's Greek egg lemon soup. Absolute fools in the chat right now. Making fools of yourselves. It's Looker! Kerchunk, yes! It is opened. I'll go on ahead. A what? Not going to be using this one. I'm going to let me know these D's nuts. I don't get it, Phil. I love how they always get, like, scientists on their side. The, the, the evil teams always have scientists on their side. Never another... It's like, sometimes businessmen, but always scientists. Has mold breaker, whatever that means. Uh, all right, we'll go to a nibble here. Granados has a lot of attack. Who has more defense, Toxic Couch or a Nibble? A Nibble by a margin, a small margin. Stealth Rock. I'll handle Stealth Rock. Thank you very much. Goodbye. 
With great science comes great evil. <laughs> Classic phrase. Can hit stuff with levitate with the ground moves, gotcha. Ignores their their uh, ability, right? I don't like this Pokemon's face. By the way, we also have a fossil. Before we get too into this bizarre music that seems to be written in like 11.7 or something, um, let's <laughs> go hatch that fossil at Oraberg. Seven Eleven, actually. Ah, easy mistake to make. Oh my god, he's got a friggin' chachat on him, I forgot. I think we've already done a Helix Fossil, but... The Fossil could be a rat. It's feasible. Oh my god, Phil. We're gonna put Spooky in here, and we're gonna have a nibble visit with Earth Maul in the nice zone real quick. Earth Maul's like, my little baby, all grown up. Tell me, what happened to Verboten and the rest of the gang? Chatot. Okay. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I hate Chatot. <laughs> All right, the Helix Fossil is another Grodel. <laughs> it could be another Don Vito, dude. <laughs> Don V2. I think we don't use them, dude. I think we just keep using Spooky and... There is another. <laughs> Dune V2. Don V2. They're growing on trees, out of rocks. Any competition for Don V2? Dead V2? Doom 2? Don V2, literally, like V2. Unfortunately, too long, Josh. Don V2 is absolutely gonna win it. I can recognize momentum. Don V2. All right, let's go put them in a box and get our friends back. Version two, baby. This one, this one will protect. Protect the children. The children of the future type situation here. All right, a nibble's coming back. Let's go ahead and... Do that. Sometimes you have to have a box for your Phoebus that can't evolve. Although Phoebus could evolve now. I could just buy like seven Poffins or whatever. I could get a Melodic at this point. Pay to win. Really is. Since I can't make Poffins, really.
I feel like this music's gonna crash my game. I'm saving. And this is completely normal. Yeah, they're, they're like, we want Cowboy Bebop, and then this is what happened. A timer ball, folks. And I'll say Milotic. I say Melodic, like exotic. I don't know what the mill is, but. What with that creepy Charon and a kid like you around, the AQ's HQ's not the same anymore. You characters change the character of the place. <laughs> Millhouse plus exotic. Melodic is just an exotic Millhouse. All right, Mama's Wine will take down a Doduo with an ice punch. I'll outspeed the Doduo too. That's an easy one-hit KO there. Don't you put that evil on me, Daffy. Metapod. Metapod. <clears throat> it's just cowboys bebopping all over the place. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Artisan Dudley! Why don't you all go, 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 just go get all cocky about it. Why don't you go get friggin' all cocky about it, then? I'm the gruntiest of the grunts. I still don't know how the warp panels connect. Really holding out for those level up moves, yeah. Like Venus de Milo. Oh. All right. It's a good Pokemon. It's a good Pokemon. Do we take, let's see what our stats are. Our defense is probably the worst on the team here. Surprisingly, I, I'm surprised by that. Um, McRib has good defense. Big has okay defense. I think we go McRib here. Toxic Couch, what are we looking at? Better defense still than than uh, Mama Swine. Plus, I can punch him to recover HP. All right, we'll go Toxic Couch and recover HP afterwards. Lovely kiss. All right. Drain Punch. This guy giving me a lovely kiss and putting me to sleep. Wow. Ugh. Get absolutely kissed with it. Stop kissing me. She's just kissing me over and over again. It's enough. Yeah, the first sentence there, you were talking about my uh, poke edge, Deffy. Because I only use the dousing machine. Am I right? Hey, vacuum wave, as if on cue. Never seen that move before. I could give someone vacuum wave and the person I can give it to is unsurprisingly toxic couch. I love how that grunt doesn't know how the warp panels work and just just like, I don't know, I don't, uh, I, I can't do a basic try and check here. 
I'm like this close to getting my promotion to commander. I'll impress our great boss by making you our newest trophy. I don't think you are, but I suppose we'll find out briefly. Three Pokemon. Mr. Mime level 41. Didn't even make him a stronger Pokemon, a stronger trainer doesn't look like. Ice Punch. I'm gonna turn our hide into a trophy, yeah. Not screwing around with the threat there at all. Pretty serious threat. Spooky and Groot level 31, dude. All right, we do have to switch for this. If we had a, if we had a lot of speed and a guaranteed hit ground move, we wouldn't have to, but we do have to. A nibble. All right, peace. Remember when we were talk Remember when we were talking about um when I was talking about Skun Tank, how that typing is really good? Drapion has the same typing. They were like, this guy's gotta eradicate. We might want to promote him. I wish this never happened. Sorry, bud. Yeah, it does. It does set you back to square one, and you will get busted down to gruntiest of the grunts, dude. Get grunted, dude. I'm gonna check the staircase and then go back. I have a feeling the staircase is not, I feel this is an item. If I was a comedy relief sort of bad guy, I'd tell you, but I don't know. Hey. Too young to understand the changing times. I'm, um, I'm an adult. <laughs> oh, the being of emotion. Okay, um, we don't have our dark type yet. Probably McRib, right? I think it's gotta be McRib. No, oh, spooky in. Meditate, oh my God. I, I intimidated it and then it meditated. I think we just outrage here, right? If it uses like Destiny Bond, I wouldn't want to outrage. Okay, we'll, we'll start with Spatial Rend. It's weaker because it's a special attack, but it can crit, so yeah. High crit chance, easy peasy, goodbye Mesprit, the being of emotion. Wow, that person, that person engages in journaling, I think. <laughs> that was That was some good, like, good reasoning at the end of the battle there. That person does some morning uh, morning journaling and uh, nighttime reflection. You know? Was that a grunt named Kimberly? It was. Hey now, our HQ is a state-of-the-art facility. A snot-nosed kid like you ought to keep your dirty hands to yourself. I'm going to kill your dudes. I'm going to kill your dudes. And I'm gonna like it. Crobat, that's a good Pokemon. It's a very good Pokemon. Solid X defend there. Bounce, okay. Um, as long as it doesn't paralyze, we'll we'll kill him here. I'm not worried about bounce killing map. Just do the move, don't. Okay, thank you. Bounce is like 85% chance to hit also, right? It's like, it doesn't hit a lot.
Hey. We're super effective against it. It's neutrally effective against us because we have flying as well as fire. Arctic Uno. I... I need to catch a break. Fire move thaws. What? I've never heard that in my entire life. Is that a thing? Um, all right, we'll use this. Lower my speed now. That'll do a little bit more. Okay. But luckily, neither of them is powerful enough to kill. We've seen three ice moves now. None of them are really good. I admittedly never get frozen. Well, la di da, Waxy Frenchie. Must be nice to not suffer from being frozen every time they use an ice move. I'll admit, I, uh. <laughs> I never lose any HP, actually. <laughs> ice shard, okay, good. Nothing thaws you from the inside out. That's also the problem with um, just leaving your food out um, from the freezer. Nothing thaws it from the inside out. It thaws from the outside in. Guys, I'm gonna be trying to make some oat milk ice cream today. I, I My uh, uh, great uncle was kind enough to give me uh, his old ice, ice cream maker. Um, and I'm gonna be trying to make some oat milk ice cream. I'm gonna use oat milk, uh, peanut butter for the fat, uh, banana for flavor, cinnamon, uh, and maybe brown sugar for the sweetener, and then a splash of bourbon at the end. That is a great uncle. You're absolutely right. Oatmeal ice cream. I mean, it is gonna be kind of like an oatmeal ice cream, I guess. I guess I could call it that. Peanut butter is the, like, I think I might, I'm not, I'm not sure on the peanut butter yet. I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it the first time. Um, because I don't have any other nut butter. Um, and you need fat um, if you don't have cream. I put bananas and cinnamon in your daily oatmeal. Exactly. Getting hit by a fire move thaws you. TM66, what was that? Force, okay. This guy is very dumb. Love to see it, folks. The Team Galactic members range from being extremely stupid to like pretty smart and self-aware to very stupid and self-aware. And I appreciate that. All right, the legendaries are back in action, folks. There's something smelly about you. I think it's your own team. I think that's what you're, sti you're smelling. I think you're smelling the stink of your jump fluff that leads with worry seed. Are they required to get the same blue bowl haircut? They are. That's not a wig. They all get that haircut. They have an in-house barber.
It is a delightful looking little guy. It's a horrible Pokemon, but it is, does look cool. I like, I, I, that, not cool, it doesn't look cool. I take that back, but it doesn't. Dragon Claw, a million years, wouldn't have guessed that move was coming down the pipes. Drain Punch, a million years, I would have guessed it. Um, I'm not that bad at guessing. <laughs> A million years is a long time. <laughs> uh, do gone, you're absolutely right. Best TM ever, dude. I wouldn't be able to make any more guesses after about 40 years. Hey, give me, give me 60 years at least. Do me the courtesy of saying live to a hundred, or live, that's not a hundred. Don't, can't do math. All right, pop off. I'm gonna, Jesus, this music. This music is something. Right, we're gonna leave, heal up. How is this the top of the song? Lead with the part that makes sense and then get into this solo. What on earth? Pixel thin line of the background moving under the game screen. Bit. There you go. I think I fixed it. Uh, not quite. It's not just a pixel, it's a couple pixels. Now it's at the top, is that good? I got it? Yeah, I got it. Okay. Thank you, Mossy Beard. I appreciate you bringing it up. Let's do this real quick because I'm very nervous about that type of stuff now. I agree, Shan. People here are very perceptive. They never, it, it, even if it's just a pixel. If it seems like Shahan and I have an inside joke, it's because we do. Oh, explicitly mentioning something for the first time. Oh, what's going on here? What the heck? Okay, teleport out. I perceive your typo. Fucking roasted. This music kind of bothers me. I'm gonna be totally honest, it does kind of bother me. <laughs> it's just a little too manic. It makes me feel a little bit like I'm, like, I, like I'm hallucinating. Oh, you like the distort command? Where am I supposed to go? Oh, I'll probably go in the front door. I see. I've learned, I've learned my lesson, folks. I'm stupid. 
That's true, Sweet Tate. This music is unexpected at every moment, like a dugong with sh dragon claw. You never know what to expect. Gaga Guawa. Hey, thanks for the follow, Kana. Uh, yeah. Ugh. Ugh, I'm so indecisive. Okay. I did have a green frame in previous streams. You're absolutely correct. There was a Psyduck in Snowpoint City that said Gaga Guawa, which seems not like something a, a Psyduck would say. Can I buy lemonade here? Uh, I can't give money to Team Galactic. I like how I'm gonna open this door right in front of this guy and he's gonna be like, yeah, that's chill. Yeah, it's, it's that level of manic for sure. It's definitely, it like erases whatever is in my mind. Having fun scampering around our HQ, you sneaky intruder. If you just change the tone on this, this is basically how I talk to Apollo. <laughs> These are the words I say. Okay, I don't, I don't say that. <laughs> I don't tell Apollo his trailblazing will go out in a blaze of glory. Uh, Swampert's water ground. Right about now, I wish we could switch to Don Vito. Um, instead, we're gonna go to McRib, I think. You should, that's an epic sentence. It is a good sentence. Wrong, Swampert is Dragon Psychic. Steel Wing! They just keep hurling unexpected moves at me. You can never, you never know what you're getting with Team Galactic, folks. Ba 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 ta 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 sha 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 Steel Wing, of course, why didn't I think of that? Hit him with a spatial rend for a little bit of flavor. God, that animation slaps. I'm just gonna rend his space, dude. Vibrava. Oh, I know what we're using against Vibrava, folks. Boom! Dead. 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 Hundo P. Dead. Executed. Dead. Crit! Wow! That was... That was 720 base power move right there with a crit. Whew. Or not base power, but... 720 power move. Your trailblazing streak went... Bleh, I can't talk. Moving on over. Mama's wine, baby. This one dead dragonfly. It really is. You should be tired out by now. It's Team Galactic's turn to shine. I've had one battle in this building so far. You guys not know about Pokemon centers? How many Pokemon have we, uh, you know, retired? I think 16. I think that number is 16. It's been a rough run in many cases. Seventeen. Seventeen if you count the one that's actually retired, yeah. Hippopotas, use your legs, dude. Okay, we fought a Palkia before. We fought a Palkia before. Um, and it had, if I remember correctly, all water moves. I 
I think also it had no dragon moves. It had zero dragon moves. Um, yes, it was 20 levels lower. Yes. Pro uh, probably about 15 levels lower. It was around level 30-ish. Um, water would be super effective against Mama's Wine. Uh, if he uses water, then McRib will kill next turn. But if he uses Dragon, it could be lethal. And I don't know if I can live with myself if McRib dies. Also, I don't know if I could live through this fight if McRib dies. A Nibble would also benefit from being not very effective with a water move, but would not suffer from super effective on a dragon move. A Nibble, though, does not have good attacks. Big cannot be the swap. And Toxic Couch cannot be the swap either. So my options are, I Ice Punch for neutral damage, and I hope on my pretty good attack here doing this. Um, or I switch to McRib, hoping for a water move. I think if we lose Mama's Wine, that's bad. But if we lose McRib, that might be lethal for the team. Um, like, I think if McRib dies, I think we've lost. <clears throat> so I think we have to either switch to a Nibble or use Mama's Wine. I think I'd rather actually at this point keep Mama's Wine over a Nibble. I know that's gonna be very unpopular with the chat, uh, but water moves are, yeah, it's also a better Pokemon to use because I have better defense, same HP, uh, and one of the moves is not very effective against a Nibble. So a Nibble is the move here. Crab Hammer, okay, I, I made the right choice. Cause that that's 120 damage against uh, the other Pokemon. Okay, so what we're gonna wanna do here is Psybeam and hope for some confusion. Palkia's water type because they didn't have one yet. They didn't have a water dragon legendary yet. <laughs> That's my analysis of it. Okay, I'm gonna use a milk here. Isn't Dialga space and Palkia time? No, you're right, you're right. Uh, are you right? I don't remember. Aqua Ring, wow. That's pretty funny. Okay, so three water moves. Four water moves. So we're safe either way. Um, we'll just use side beams. There we go. All right. I'm glad we didn't stay on uh, Mama's Wine. What's your rush? Dialga's time, okay. Palkia's water type because water is purple. Is this gonna tell me that uh, Mew gave birth or something? The creation of Dialga, the giver of time and laughter, there's tears and likewise it is with time for the the same time flows on, for it is the blessing of Dialga. We stole part of the words. I won't let you disrupt our research. Ah, he's watching TV, guys. Oh, Corndog, no! That sucks. I'm sorry to hear that. He's watching friggin' TV, dude. X special. What's up, Waku? Put 
put that fossil on ice, baby. I got whipped. I look pathetic. It's a weird thing to say, like, for a scientist to say. All right. Ice to meet you. Oh, it's Looker. This might be the thing that continues on the quest, so let's dip out and get whatever items we can. Slash battles. An X defend, folks. Why, do you think it's running, Shahan? You know what that means, folks. We can evolve the kernel. <laughs> Drink all you wish and gain the energy to move us forward. The refrigerator is filled with murky, sinister drinks. Dude, I hate sinister drinks. This MF feeding me sinister drinks. Cutscene? Ah. They're like, okay, Cyrus gets to put his hair up. He gets the same bowl cut, but he puts he gets to put gel and mousse in it. My name, as I appear to you today, is Cyrus. This world of ours is a crude one. In a word, it is incomplete. It has been and always will be a struggle to survive in this world. We humans and Pokemon are likewise incomplete. Because we are also lacking, we fight, we maim, it is ugly. I hate the incompleteness. That we are all incomplete, I hate it with my entire body and being. The world should be complete. The world must change. What's up, Darksider? Then who will change it? Me, Cyrus, and Team Galactic. Yes, all of you. Together we poured over myths and exposed their secrets. Together we captured legendary Pokemon and now Team Galactic has obtained the energy to change the world. The power of dreams is within our grasp. Understand it, fellow members. Believe it. My long held dream world is on the verge of becoming reality. All those headed to Mount Coronet and those who remain here, though our missions may differ, our hearts beat as one. Let there be glory. For Team Galactic, Ruh. You sure can, Darksider. All right. That was Cyrus, the boss of Team Galactic. Mesmerizing for one only 27 years old. But to make a world for Team Galactic and none other? Dude, this MF accomplishing so much, making me jealous. All right, see you, Looker. You weirdo. All right, here's the team. We got a Mama's Wine, a Toxicouch, a Big, a McRib, a, a Nibble, and a Spookian. We're working at it. We got a lot of corpses in the uh, in the old. <laughs> that was not what I was expecting to happen. I fell asleep quickly. I love how you can always take a nap in the evil team's headquarters. Interestingly, Charizard is one of the weaker Pokemon on the team right now, Darksider. I'm, I'm su as surprised as you are. You're famous. We get a promotion if we put you down. Jesus. Hmm. That's a very strong Pokemon. Um... Uh, I think... I think we switched to big. <laughs> Kidding. Um... We could use, uh, uh, we could use our ground move, but if we miss, we might be in trouble. Um, and that's what we're gonna do. 
All right, we got it. We should win. It's a pretty good crit. Probably would have killed without the crit, unless we only hit twice, but I think we dodged a little bit of a bullet there, folks. That thing has a lot of attack. All right. Gonna do the same thing against Lyron. <laughs> Look at his gummy smile and small freaking arms. Yeah, Ramparados does not have much defense. Has a lot of attack, but... Wow, this person is literally a rock trainer. Got Vacuum Wave off. And now we Bone Rush. We'll, oh, pretty strong Pokemon, huh? Four, give me one more, give me one more. Uh, all right, that's okay. This should be lethal. Horrible moves on this Regirock. Can someone edit loss onto Regirock's face? <laughs> onto the dots? Yeah, never bone rush. Good rule. Gunk shot, folks! Dude, we could shoot some gunk. 12070. The user shoots filthy garbage at the foe to attack. That's when you send people the link to this stream, am I right? All right. Why did I do that? There's a bed right there. Why did I use a milk? Are you enjoying your unescorted, unauthorized, and unsettling tour of our HQ? Yes. Artisan Veronica sent out Magby. <clears throat> yeah, bed doesn't isn't as tasty as milk. I'm gonna definitely kill this Magby. Probably just the one, yeah. Bye. Croconaw. Don't really have anything for uh, water types yet. We'll go make rib for now. I guess we really should be using um, our Don V2, but. Oh well. Outrage, baby! Popped! Yeah, McRib is really strong. Strong Pokemon there. We're not too far away. <laughs> Let me do what I want! <laughs> Very funny thing to say after you lose a Pokemon battle. <laughs> Hey, come on, let me do what I want. Charcoal. That's very true, Shahan. You like Infernape a lot? Infernape's a cool Pokemon. I like Infernape. Power Lens, a second Power Lens, folks. Any uh, dousing? Aha. Uh -huh. Uh, what? An old cake? All right. Sure. Found a freaking old cake. All right. Uh... What levels am I looking at for, for a Cyrus battle here? I'm 
gonna see if this works here. Ah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I'd say we're over leveled, if anything. Yeah, I, I'm sure. I'm sure they're not gonna have any level 50 Pokemon when we round this corner. I think if if since we're under leveled, we would have to lead with McRib or a Nibble. 40 to 43, really? All right. That's weird. Very weird scaling then. So it'll be 44 to 47, 44 to 48. Okay, we'll try it. What's the worst that could happen? I think I'm still gonna lead with Toxic Couch though. So you've come. Are you kidding me, SmackDown? <sighs> Never listen to chat, ever. Rule number one, Phil. Oh my God, okay. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Here we go. No worries, guys. It's not gonna be a strong Pokemon, so it won't matter. <laughs> oh dear! Oh dear! Oh boy! Ooh, I got trolled kind of hard on this one. All right. Why would you stop there? Okay, so Future Sight's gonna hit kind of hard. Okay. Withdrew. Okay. <laughs> oh, he withdrew Electivire to send out Hoppip, who is four times weak to ice. What? <laughs> what? I mean, he can't use electric moves on me, but what? Okay. All right. All right. We're back. We're back in the. Uh... I I think we go big here because steel, steel fighting, right? It is strange he didn't switch to this uh, immediately. Uh, we'll go there. Okay, let's see another move. Shit, misclick. All right, big. Let's do this. Oh, that hop-ip. Iron defense is not what I love to see. Not when I'm about to use a physical fire move. Okay, so sharply raised. It's still the best move to use, but... Wow, okay, so I'm gonna have to use special moves to kill this, unless I can burn it. This isn't gonna do anything. Oh, actually, we'll get there. 
like this. Dynamic punch! Good move. A little bit scary. Confuses me, right? Every time. Okay, so it's got uh, fighting moves, fighting moves, high jump kick, dynamic punch, um, iron defense. We got one more. Um, What's, okay, Big has 75 defense. Toxic Couch actually has more. It's Toxic Couch's turn to shine with a fighting move. Because if he uses fighting, it's not very effective still. We'll do less damage against him. Dy okay, Dynamic Punch stinks, but. Doesn't that have a 50% chance to hit, by the way? I'll heal first in case he's got a strong steel move as well. That might have been the right move. Let's see if I made a good decision there. I made a good decision there. Um... It's a tough Pokemon. Fighting's not very effective against flying. Steel's neutral. Uh, McRib has more defense. It's gonna do 25% less against McRib. Okay. 87. Down 25% is like 65 or something. A crit would be fine. Okay, um, that's a 46, a crit won't kill, Aeroblast should kill him. Got him, okay. And now, finally, Electivire. My last Pokemon. Have I made a big boo-boo? Have I made a big boo-boo? I hope I didn't just make a big boo-boo. I hope I didn't just make a big boo-boo. Okay, more than half, I'm good. I'm fine. No big boo-boo. And I one-shot him. <laughs> boo-boos? Who was talking about boo-boos? Who was in the chat talking about boo-boos? No boo-boos here. Zero boo-boos. Look at those stats. No boo-boos here. Zero boo-boos detected. I see, you are indeed strong. You have made zero boo-boos. And, <laughs> and the basis of your power is your compassion toward Pokemon. How wasteful. <laughs> oh boy. He gave me a reward of a Master Ball, dude. Thank you, Rory. I don't use Pokemon as tools. I make the power Pokemon my own. That sounds like using Pokemon as tools, dude. That sounds like, sounds like the definition of it, in fact. What did he say about the teleporter? Let me go heal. I just don't want to get caught by all of his commanders in a triple battle because I wasn't reading dialogue. I can make the power of this bandsaw my own. I love to fall asleep in this bed. I can't read dialogue with this music. This music, this music is a, a, uh, an auditory attack. This music is responsible for Havana syndrome, dude. Oh, this is how you give your speech, okay.
It's, you could Google Havana Syndrome. Am I in the basement in Undertale? Soft sand. I feel awful about what we did. The experiment went too far. We are in the basement in Undertale. Dude, we're suspending shit in a green fluid. Mountain Dew? Suspended in a green fluid? What am I, a toxic gamer in Mountain Dew? Oh, check it out! Yo, what the heck? Why am I saving? I can't do, I have to, I, I get one shot by definition. Why am I saving? All right. It appears to be suffering, dude. Dude, Mesprit, the being of emotion. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's just put, uh, yeah, we could leave this. Let's see what's going on. That is so weird that I'm battling the commander after I battled Cyrus, but. All right, weightlifter Wellington. I guess I probably. All right, so he's, he's flying normal. I probably could kill in one shot, just in case. I'm gonna switch to uh, McRib and just. You don't fight them here. Yeah, sorry SmackDown, I'm uh, uh, officially checking to see if the person sending the message is SmackDown Soup, and if so, not listening from here on out. <laughs> That's my new policy. All right. <laughs> I think they meant the legendaries to be fair. But also, Gaga Guwawa. Right on. We'll go and nibble for that. Hit him with a surf. Sent out Rhydon, withdrew Rhydon. What? Oh, Koala Baritone, certainly don't worry about Pokemon missing from the team while I'm training a level 34 uh, Scoriopi. Uh, Surf's actually more powerful than Psybeam in this instance, I believe. Take a quick look. Psybeam's 6,500, so it's 130. Uh, this is actually 140, so Surf's a little bit better, actually. Gastro Acid, dude. Yeah, it's also certainly, there's no other Pokemon missing from the team either. Gunk Shot, that's a strong, powerful move. It's a strong, powerful move. Did not crit, did not poison. A crit poison would not have killed either, um, but it would have been enough for me to not be able to kill the Rhydon, who's coming out now and dying now. I can fast forward through it because it's dead. Easy peasy, dude. Weightlifter Wellington, not a good showing. Not a good showing from you. Um, I'm gonna heal up and then talk to this other guy. I probably don't have to fight him, but. Worth checking. Mmm, this guy's gonna go rogue. Set the Pokemon free, dude. You gotta. Peace. Our boss crafted a red chain from crystals he took from the three Pokemon. That red chain is what he needed to shackle something on Mount Coronet. It's also apparently needed for creating something. But that's all I know. Who knows what he's planning to do up there? Yeah, he's certainly not planning on shackling anything up there. You idiot. Who knows, he says. Wait, Charon is the only one still there? Maybe he says something else after. Probably just says the same thing, but just in case. Yeah, I have four red flutes. Can I do the same same thing with the flutes?
Yeah, he just made it as a present. Okay, now this is open. Get me out of here. Get this music stopped. Music <laughs> is a sonic attack. Oh boy, folks. He had three red crystals, I have four red flutes. Flutes, four is greater than three, therefore I have the better equipment. That's true, that's why I defeated him. Folks, thank you very much for joining for this episode of Pokemon Sunday.